We're at the Mumbai Tech Week, joined by the Commissioner of Police, Mumbai City, Mr. Vivek Fansalkar. Sir, firstly, thank you for speaking to us. Uh, your session, you said, uh, uh, tackling uh, crimes, uh, uh, the, mainly cyber crimes you spoke about. How important is it to talk about technology-related crimes and educate the audience and the public at large? Well, it's very, very important, extremely important. In fact, you see that technology is making inroads into uh, the individuals and the society's life in a very, very big way. Now everyone almost has a device, an electronic device at his fingertips. We have uh, internet banking, we have internet reservations of travel plans and you know everything is now becoming digital and therefore digital safety, digital security is also very, very important. Every citizen needs to know and be aware as to what are the dangers and the potent threats when he or she is on an electronic device. And therefore I would just like to uh, tell our citizens through you that please be aware uh, about the risks involved. Do not interact or get into any trap with uh, any unknown person or a stranger. Banks have been continuously advising you that they don't ask for passwords and sharing OTPs, etc., etc. There have been a large number of cases where people have been cheated and you know transactions have been done without their knowing or getting into a trap. So be alert. It is always better to be safe than to be in a hurry. So data is widely misused. So uh, does Mumbai police have already in place or are they contemplating having a data aggregation center wherein it becomes easier to keep a tab on individuals? But see, data aggregation is going to be very, very important uh, in uh, policing in the times to come and we are working towards it. And at the same time, data safety, data security is also going to be uh, an important aspect. As you see, many applications have already facilities of data encryption because there are issues of privacy as well as ethics. So all this combined together is going to be a very challenging and uphill task. But I'm sure that uh, the police uh, in particular and the government in general is going to rise to the occasion and ensure this happens. Sir, lastly, are cyber detection officers and uh, cyber officers increasing as rapidly as the cyber crimes are also because these are faceless individuals who are hiding behind a computer screen? Well, that uh, remains a challenge because, uh, you know, the criminals, uh, there's no limit to their numbers, but uh, there is a limit to our numbers. But we are uh, training our people uh, in uh, cyber investigation uh, in a very big way. We have... Uh, Almost uh, all 13 zones have 13 units where there are uh, specialized people, they've been trained. We also have a lot of special investigation tools and we are uh, making serious attempts to cope up with the enormity of the challenge. Yes, we need to dedicate ourselves more, commit ourselves more and uh, we also plan to ultimately educate every constable, every officer of the Mumbai police because it is going to be an integral part of policing. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much. Sir. With cameraman Nitin Varney, they've got it for India today. Mumbai.